Hi, this is Joe Decker. Welcome to another episode of the Nature Photography Sh Show, where Mike Spinak and I give you the best in photographic tips, techniques, and gear reviews. Today I want to talk about one of the most important and controversial questions in nature photography, Canon versus Nikon. It's very difficult to teach a photographic workshop or to visit a photographic forum without running into this important question. People seem to be endlessly fascinated with de debating the minutia of feature differences and build differences between different cameras. But my own take on this is probably best explained by way of a story. Some years back, my friend JD and I were photographing in the Eastern Sierra uh, along Bishop Creek Road on the road to South Lake. And it was autumn, and there were aspen, just beautifully yellow-orange aspen, all through the river valley. And we found a composition that excited both of us. Uh, beautiful trees, just in perfect uh, fall color, great composition. The only problem was it was a little late in the day. Some shadows from the side of the valley had crept into the composition by the time we found it. And we knew that the shot would be a little more perfect a bit earlier in the day. So we decided to return the following day. And the next day we did. We returned perhaps as much as an hour earlier, got our tripod set up there on the side of the road, and uh, uh, just sh shot the breeze while we waited for the uh, perfect moment of light to uh, to occur, that, that last moment where the light would be as warm as it possibly could be without these intruding sh shadows. Just as the shadow was beginning to approach the bottom of my frame, all of a sudden a white pickup truck pulled up and a pair of guys raced out and they had a very urgent question for me at this moment. They were very interested in improving their nature photography, and they were very interested in knowing whether they should be buying Canon gear or Nikon gear. This was while the incredible light was in the direction they were facing. Asked them to wait a moment, got my shot, got my backup shot, shot some vertical in addition to landscape orientation uh, uh, shots, and then turned back and said, I don't really think that it makes that much difference. The important thing is that you get some gear that's comfortable for you, that uh, if you've got some friends who are primarily involved in one brand or another and you ever want to borrow their gear, perhaps that would be a, a factor. But that both Canon and Nikon make excellent gear and uh, really it's for the vast majority of purposes, there's not a strong reason to buy one versus the other. Uh, other practical matters like can you borrow your buddy's lens, uh, turn out to be more important. I think the more important thing to say here is that um, in terms of really improving your nature photography, uh, better gear can help, but it, well, it isn't really the critical factor. What really is the critical factor in improving your nature photography, things like vision or things like composition and things like technique. And so while gear is important, uh, I hope and uh, I suspect Mike shares my view on this, that you'll uh, also look at the other ways in which you can improve your photography and, uh, and keep those in mind too. Uh, Mike and I both uh, uh, teach uh, a variety of photographic workshops, often together, and we hope you'll look at our offerings, take a look at our websites, give us a ring, be happy to talk to you more. Thanks.